2010, but the Madison Common Council is again debating the future of the Edgewater expansion. The Edgewater project is back in the spotlight tonight. A motion before the city council could breathe new life into the waterfront hotel's redevelopment. News 3's David Douglas is live outside the council chambers with a look ahead at what's coming up tonight. David? Well, Susan, it feels like deja vu to be standing here talking about the city council potentially overriding the Landmarks Commission decision, but that's because it is. And this time there's once again a familiar wrinkle with a bit of a fresh catch to it. Tonight, the council is going to reconsider the Landmarks Commission override vote once again, but there's an expected motion that would refer the project to the Urban Design Commission and to the Planning Commission before bringing this whole thing back to the council, essentially letting the project go through the rest of the city process, potentially as a way to gauge further interest before making any kind of final decision about that whole Landmarks decision. Basically, it would be a motion coming from the council. Um, asking or instructing the committees to uh, to consider their proposal uh, in time for the council to get it back to them by the meeting on February 23rd. So the talk out there is this meeting likely won't last as long as the last one did, but let's face it, folks, 5.30 in the morning would be tough to top. However, we should tell you there is once again public testimony tonight, and of course, if lots of people show up, that simply takes time. We shall see. We'll be here live tonight at 9 and 10 in high definition.